Hello YouTube, Triple Day here. Yes, this is another. Um, I'm gonna get sick and t I'm sick and tired of saying daily day review now. So for now, it's getting changed fully. It's gonna be called film review. So I'm doing a film review on one of my. It's a personal favorite film of mine, and um, yeah, and um, it's called. Jurassic Park. <laughs> yep. Personal favourite film of mine. Yeah, from Jurassic Park. This is the Jurassic Park Trilogy Pack, which contains one, two, and three. I'll show you. I'll show you. Like, as I showed you. One, two, and three. Yep. That's, I like, one, and three. I like one and three. Number two is a little bit of a um, disappointing to me, but I'll get to that in a minute. Great, great trilogy, apart from number two, but we'll get to that in a minute. Uh, yeah, um, I really enjoy these films. I really do. Number one is um, like if you want to know a bit more about them, and like um. The names of them and stuff like that. Number two, um, sadly, that's a little bit of a disappointment to me. Um, I'll tell you the reason why. Um, because it's got the same actor in. Do you know who the the person who plays Doctor Ian Malcolm? I'm forgetting his name, but he's to be honest with you, he's not that. He's not that much of a person you would see like in Jurassic Park. You see him in the first one. First one is first one, he's alright. Second one he he's on his own. He's not with Alan Grant or John Hammond anymore. Because uh he's not that pretty much fit into me like in Jurassic Park though but but then again this is my own opinion. Then again this is my opinion so Anyway, um, yeah, he's not having much cutting because, like, he's not, like, really adventurous. Not, like, not the person you would see, like, go on. Okay, right. Dinosaurs are in the middle of the island, right? No, they're on the edge of the island. I know what we're going to do. We're going to find a way out of here first before we actually... Well, we're going to... We just came here. We're going to come here to do what we're going to do, like, take pictures, experiment with them. Well, not experiment with them. Take, like, um like and um, geography things like and um, see where their natural habitat is and like see where all the animals habitat in no he's not that type of person um he's not that type uh he's more like the worried type because when he heard again spoiler below when he heard that um his girlfriend sarah had been on in the silent cause side bay yeah, there's two sites that you see on here. There's Site A and Site B. Site A is Isla Nubar, which is contains the visitor centre, the electric fences, power and all that to like um, keep the islands and animals intact and like keep them in the natural habitat. Site B, Isla Sauna, doesn't have any electric fences. But that's where the breeding the animals. I mean, come on, that is just crazy. No electric fences, no barricades, no nothing. It's the breeding centre. I mean, come on, that is, that is stupid. But yet, uh, I would say it's like good in a kind of way because it lets the animals roam free around the island. Roam free. Um, yeah, and then we'll move on to Jurassic Park 3. The third one, so back to the review. Moving on to Jurassic Park 3, Alan Grant again from number 1, he's in at number 3 now, which I totally enjoy. Um, yep, there's a lot of good scenes in it, new dinosaur in this one as well, it's, called, uh, it's a Spinosaurus or Spinosaurus gibdicus or whatever they call it, they got a long snout, long snout, like a big fin at the back. 
And yeah, it beat them my favourite dinosaur, the T-Rex. Because it grabbed hold of its neck and twisted it. Yeah, it grabbed hold of its neck and twisted it. And then it killed it, so... Yeah, that's my favourite dinosaur, T-Rex. Yep. <sighs> Go for them, pack. Um, it, it's good for the family. Like if it, it, yeah, I would recommend this. Like if you want to know more, about, like if you like dinosaurs, like this sort of thing. So, family, I would say it's like a family film for you to watch. Uh, yeah, Jurassic Park one, two, and three. It's a spine. That's the back with Taja all three of them. Two of them on here are. Directed by Steven Spielberg, the other one is not. Sad to say, it's not. First two are directed by Steven Spielberg, but third one is not. Well, I gotta say, whoever directed, or oh, Joe Johnson. Joe Johnson directed this for them. Directed the third one, but Steven Spielberg directed the first two. But Joe Johnson is doing a good job. He's doing a good job of making them. Rumours that is going around saying that there's going to be a fourth Jurassic Park film coming out. When that, if that is true, and if that, and if all those rumours are absolutely true of it coming out, I, I would honestly just. Say to myself, right, ask anybody, ask for my, for my friends up and say, ask them if you want to come and see Jurassic Park 4. And if they say yes, we'll arrange the deer and then we'll go down to the cinema and then we'll just watch it. Because honestly, I absolutely love Jurassic Park. It's one of my favourite films. And this is the Chuck G Park. So, yeah, favourite films. You got got to love Jurassic Park. A little bit disappointed in number two though, but um, could have been improved a lot better. So that's it. That's all I've got to say about Jurassic Park. Really, you you if you want to buy this, then go ahead and you buy it at any DVD stores or any um any marketplaces or any shops that like. Do stuff like this, like find them in our second hand shops. Uh, yeah, if you if you find it, I'm happy for you, and then you can just buy it, and then you just watch it. Um, yeah, that's that. So anyway, all I've got to say to you is, peace, peace.